Um, can you guys share the, um, um, the Etherpad link on IRC? First of all, Happy New Year, everyone. How is everyone doing? Yeah. Have you already forgotten about your New Year's uh, resolutions or are you sticking to them? Well, it depends on, yes, <laughs> sticking to them. Trying to, actually. <laughs> You're good. It's already January 6th and you're still sticking to them. Everybody seems to be super sleepy. Are you guys just waking yeah. up from the holidays? What yeah, was it way too long? <laughs> yeah, it should be like, oh my God, it's a new year. Let's party. Let's have fun. Let's yeah, and you, and you all, you all had things. time to, to relax a little bit, right? Oh, yeah. Yep. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, everybody's yeah. sleeping. Yes, we did relax. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to do the relax uh, uh, meeting today. Mm -hmm. We're going to start the year, you know, very relaxed. So. <laughs> okay, well, let's go to that ether pad and get started. Um, by the way, um, Michael, I think I'm, I, I don't know if I can record in this room. Um, you can, I have to show you how. Um, okay. But but I already started it. Okay, good, good, good. Sorry. So thank you very much, Michael, for starting the recording. Um, and let's get to it. Hello, everyone. Welcome to 2014. This is a, a, a great new year and many, I mean, everything remains the same. Um, but, you know, we can think, we can look at, at things differently. We can have some new goals, some new challenges. Um, and we hope that everyone had the time to take a little break during the holidays. We know not everyone in the world has holidays on the same day. Um, so for all our contributors in different cultures and countries, um, we hope you also had a little break um, and it was, it was fun. Um, so let's see, let's go to our agenda. Uh, we kind of, Melina and I were taking the temperature of the room um, and it seems to be that everyone's a little sleepy, right? Uh, so we're going to see how it goes, if maybe people can start waking up after the weekend, right? And we're going to do it. Um, before we get started, um, I wanted to you to introduce, uh, I wanted uh, to introduce you to Sabina Brown. Sabina Brown um, is going to be working with us. She's making an internship and uh, it's, it's really awesome. She's going to be focusing on community. Um, but I would rather have you, Sabina, introducing yourself, telling everyone a little bit about yourself and what you want to accomplish and uh -huh. what are you interested in. Um, I'm Sabina. I uh, live in Santa Cruz, California. Um, I am the outreach program for women uh, intern for the next three months. Um, I wanna, my background is actually in um, psychology. Uh, that's what I got my degree in, but I uh, have been working in uh, web development for a little bit. Um, and uh, not great at this. <laughs> I'm, I want to be. I want to work on um, figuring out how to. Right now, I'm, I'm a little project I did over the holiday was trying to work on figuring out how to remove some of the kind of more psychological roadblocks to becoming a contributor. Um, you know how to just uh, make it um, feel like, make someone feel like they have permission to begin uh, contributing. So, um. Yeah, th that's great. That's great. So, yeah, as you heard, Sabina has a psychology background, which is, I think it's going to be very, very useful at Sumo. And uh, I think the first step that you chose, which is to uh, make people feel welcome and to remove the, the roadblocks is, is, is amazing. So um, we'll see a lot more soon. And um, Sabina, you are also very interested in getting to know uh, our community, right? So you, you, you want to reach out to them and get involved in a couple of things, right? Yes. <laughs> I, um, my, the bigger project I really wanted to work on was uh, – Sorry, my, my, I'm still brewing my coffee. Um, no, no, no worries. We all are in need of coffee. <laughs> um, <clears throat> I wanted to work with um, people from the different uh, geographic communities to see if the documentation um, they need is uh, 
different or the same from other uh, communities and then try and uh, help create a, a localized or not localized but geographically specific um, content for them if they need it or I'm not for saying as well sorry <laughs> no 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 that, that sounds great um, so uh, as I said this is Sabina if you have any questions you can post them on IRC Sabina what's your IRC handle that's important Oh, my IRC handle is Bina, B-B-I-N-A-B. -B. Okay, so everyone who wants to reach out to Sabina, you can find her on Pound Sumo. I've seen her a lot of times, and she's very friendly. And again, if anyone has any questions, if you have ideas for Sabina, um, or if you want to, you know, just, uh, you know, ask her for some advice, uh, psychology-wise, that'd be great. And so it's it's great, Sabina, to have you here. It's a great addition to the team. And so everyone, just welcome Sabina, and uh, please let's make her feel welcome and let's help her get some very cool projects done. Thank you. Yeah, and Sabina, we hope that you have a great time with us for the three months that you were interning, and don't forget to have fun. Okay, I'm on it. <laughs> okay. Perfect. Uh, Fantastic. So um, I think that we, we, we're not going to have a lot of updates this week, right? Um, but let's see, Kazir, you want to say anything about the development updates? Sorry, I was muted. Uh, so th this week is a little bit special. I'm just going to mention why, because this is the first week of the year. And there were a number of things that we deployed uh, last year. So we will we will need to look at what stuff we broke, uh, what things we need to fix uh, before we can actually uh, come up with a sprint planning uh, list. What we can already say is that from the roadmap items, we will be working on a Thunderbird migration. Hopefully, that's going to go smooth. Um, but other than that, uh, the it feels a little bit un incomplete on the other path to sprint planning. Yet that's because it is. Um, it's a little time before we know exactly what's going on. But if you uh, want to stay on top, you can always link. Um, and that one is going to be uh, up to date tomorrow. Uh, so you'll be able to see what's going to go into the sprint. Oh, I was muted. OK, thanks, Kadir. That, that sounds great. And um, just a quick heads up now that you're talking about that. Um, I think that the first weeks of the year are going to be a little um, everyone's going to be trying to figure out how the year is going to work and what we're going to do. And I want to say already today that next week we're probably not having this meeting as everyone will be traveling. Um, so just mark your calendars. Unfortunately, no meeting next week. Um, but if there's anything that you want to know or ask, um, you can always do that on the forums. But um, just, don't, just let me know that we'll, we won't be having this meeting next week. Good. Um, Roundtable items. I think that everyone uh, is, was very busy with the holiday. Um, and of course, there was not, not a lot going on at Sumo, so I see no roundtable items. Um, so why don't we go to Firefox OS and, and a little bit of time today and not too many options so that we warm up for the, for the next weeks. <laughs> Hermina, you want to take that one? Yes, sure. Yes, not not a lot of uh, not lots of updates. The only thing I've been working on since coming back from holidays is an issue, a possible issue we've been seeing with the LG phone, with the the, the Leo phone. It seems that uh, for some users there is an issue when calling. Uh, they got interrupted during the call and they put the other uh, uh, the other user on hold. So we are trying to to see what the cause of this. We've seen this issue already uh, during summertime, and now uh, it seems that it's uh, it's back. It's not confirmed yet. Um, I'm I'm still waiting to to hear from our engineers here and see what uh, what they think. But that's the only okay. that's the only thing. Can you need any? Do you need any help from the community, Hermina? Uh, we, actually, we we had a chat with the community just before the holidays around this. Because we got some some feedback as well from some community members on on the issue, and we've already asked them, and I'll uh, take the the opportunity to ask them again if they encountered the same 
uh, please uh, wrote us or uh, send us your, your feedback as well. Okay, fantastic. Thank you, Hermina. So everyone who's on the LG, uh, please send Hermina uh, the feedback. I've been testing the Alcatel in Colombia and it's very cool, but still has some um, things we have to get over, but uh, it's very cool. I'm, I'm using it on, on a daily basis. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Uh, so Firefox for Android, Roland, I would skip it normally because you say always only read the update, but we haven't heard your voice in this year, so please. You're muted. That's the whole point. We want to hear you. Hello, Andrew, without a microphone. Um, it is cold here in Vancouver. It was minus three, and it was a gay collection, as in the, in the old sense of happy, uh, of bicyclists this morning. I was monitoring the email like a paranoid uh, person over the holidays and looking at the support forums, and there appears to be nothing uh, with Firefox 26 for Android. Uh, we appear to have no documentation to write for Firefox 27 for Android. So, uh, super awesome. Happy New Year. That's my voice update and Thunderbird migration, as we said. And uh, I will see you all on the Ethernets. Great. Ethernets. Something nets. <laughs> yeah, you look like you're very cold, Roland. Uh, it is minus three. Uh, Celsius. Fahrenheit, right? Celsius. Oh, Celsius. Oh, minus three uh, Celsius. I was like. It's like that okay. here. <laughs> wow. Okay, well, thanks a lot. Thanks a lot, Roland, that you updated us. Oh, yes. I have to do the 10 thumbs up for this year, or 14 times. Yeah, okay. <laughs> That's good. Cool. So how about, um, how about the metrics? Kadir, is there anything you want to talk about? Uh, th there is an update on the Etherpad. Uh, that's the only thing that I would say. Like, essentially, the uh, soft rate is is uh, low, and we have just seen that today. Uh, so we need to look into that and figure out. Right, that. right. I I also noticed that we have a lot of uh, the the contributors that were picking before uh, uh, picking before Christmas, and now they went down, um, especially for l n So I think that one can be that people are focused on on holidays, right, and being with the family. The second thing, at least in terms of, of localization, the last time I checked, and it was almost at the end of December, we had only put five articles ready for um, localization, ready for l n and the whole month of December. Um, so I think that there's a, there's a great influence on in how many articles we put ready for localization and how many active contributors we have. So just taking into account that we haven't released a lot of work, people don't get as many notifications, and maybe they forget. So that's, um, that's a possible explanation. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, there is also uh, like a correlation with the summit. Uh, when, yes. uh, during the summit and shortly after the summit, there was lots of uh, contributions. There is lots of excitement. So um, that, that dropped a little bit. And um, yeah, we can get people excited about that again. Right. Um, right. But, but as I yeah. said, I, I think that we should, we should wait until the year starts um, before we get too worried about you know, contributor numbers mm -hmm. and everything. Because I think the holidays, uh, um, you know, people are just you know, busy and they're with family and friends. So um, let's, let's wait and see if next week we celebrate still in that um, stage. Otherwise, um, if you can check something, Kadir, that would be great. Otherwise, we'll just give everyone a break. <laughs> and it's still a holiday in Sweden and in many other countries. Yeah. yeah. I mean, we hope. I haven't I, I started mean, my computer for one week. That's like uh, if other people did that, then yes, <laughs> that's probably. Well, uh, and and but you know we can't forget that people in holidays are also having issues. So whoever is there on on call can help us solve the issues. That's great. Um, but you know we're we're trying to understand why people are of course a little bit less involved. But that's great. Um, so community, we had the introduction of Sabina. I just wanted to do that on the very first moment, Sabina. So we already talked about you. Um, and I wanted to, I, Madalena and I, we, before we, we went on the holiday, we worked on the numbers and seeing the community growth for 2013. And it was really, it was very, very good. I mean, we grew across the board uh, at around 20%, right? Um, the, the English KB was the lowest one, um, but every, everywhere, and, and it wasn't even low, it was like 18% growth, which is, I mean, like, it's very good compared to 2012. And then we have um, localization, the forum was like the biggest growing, 
area of sumo, Army of Awesome grew also a lot. Um, and we grew not only in, in terms of numbers of contributors, but also the amount of work that we get done, like grew amazingly, right? So we're getting like 15 to 20% more work done than last year. Um, so we really increased our capabilities and, 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 you know, we were very happy. We posted a list of the top contributors and I've, I've received some messages like, oh, I was contributing a lot. Why aren't, aren't I, uh, you know, why can't I find myself in that top uh, contributor list? Um, so just be assured, uh, the, the contributors that you see in that top uh, 12 list, I think I made, made, a, made it around 12 people, um, are the, the, the contributors with the highest, highest numbers in general terms, I mean, like in, throughout the whole year. So uh, bear with us, even if you were like a top, top contributor for many weeks, um, maybe what, there was someone who was a top contributor for many more weeks. Uh, so but it doesn't mean that your work's not counting, and if, even if we didn't put all the names there, uh, we had to make a cut somewhere, um, but we want to thank everyone for their uh, amazing contributions um, and, you know, for the growth. Madalena, I would like to pass it to you, or maybe you want to say something else. Yes, I wanted to say, first of all, um, again, thank you everybody for their amazing contributions. In 2013, we wouldn't have grown so much. It was actually quite surprising because we didn't expect these numbers. Um, we knew that we were doing better, but not that well. So again, thank you everybody for all your great work. And even if you're not on the top 10 list, uh, do not worry. <laughs> if we would have uh, written everybody's name, we'd have probably like broken down the web. Um, so this is why we're kind of restricting the, the list. So there's a lot a lot of people who helped us and contributed to, to sumo in 2013 so our thanks go to everybody um and we're very happy that that you like contributing to sumo and that uh, sumo is a, a fun place for you to be so we hope to see you again this year in 2014 uh and we can do more awesome stuff uh together so thank you guys so much Everything. Yes, absolutely. And I, I think that one of the most important things for me is I think that, you know, it, it wasn't just because Marlena and I were like screaming at you guys like uh, cheerleaders, like, come on, grow, grow, grow. I think that this is actually the effort of a lot of contributors, a lot of people who are, you know, everyone's very encouraging, very welcoming. If you look at the uh, introduce yourself thread, there's always people jumping in and welcoming others and trying to guide people throughout Sumo. Um, so, so I think that this is really the community growing, you know, in an organic way and people being more welcoming and, and I think that that is like the, the most beautiful part of it. Yeah, and one more thing here, I think that what we've noticed 2013, which is really, really important, we, we've seen a lot of people taking a lot of leadership within the community, so it's not just us. Uh, you know, as Rosanna said, cheering and doing things, but there are a lot of community members who actually uh, organize things and they really, really uh, took, uh, took up leadership roles. So this is super important uh, and I'm very happy to see that, that happening. Um, so I know this is a difficult thing to do, to take ownership and do everything yourself, by yourself, but it shows how great our sumo community is actually that we have so many people who, who want to do this. So thanks guys um, for also taking some some of the whole like organized organization work off our backs. That's that's really cool. Yeah, and uh, you know, I did this little uh, DIY infographic. You can see there how much we grew, where you can see how many contributors we have and, and the numbers are pretty amazing. We have 159 people in the KB. 583 people on localization, 241 people on the forums, and 882 people working, you know, collaborating in Army of Awesome. So, you know, these this numbers are really big. Uh, so thank you, everyone, uh, and let, let's keep it growing. I mean, I, I hope that next year we have just as many new contributors, if maybe not more, we'll see. Um, but uh, we'll do that with a little help of our friends, right, of our small friends. <laughs> Uh, well, that's like very good news. So um, why don't we go to the knowledge base? Michael. Um, the one and only really big thing, which it'll be like the big thing for the next like three months is, hey, we have this new version of Firefox coming out uh, at the end of April. And oh, almost all the articles need to be updated for it. Not, well, a lot of them. 
it, it, it may be over the 50% mark. I've still not actually done counting. Um, but anyway, so um, just before uh, the break, I posted in the localization forum the, a list of some templates that I updated. They actually, those templates actually account for many of the updates to be done. Um, it's th things like the menu paths to get things now is all in the new menu button kind of thing, which is really nice. It actually simplifies things because it's the same path for Windows, Mac, and Linux instead of three different paths, you know, um, which, yay, that's cool. Um, but anyway, there's a ton of articles to update and a schedule and thing is still forthcoming, but the basic idea is um, uh, basically we'll be updating articles every week, uh, setting new bunches of articles ready for localization every week between now and probably all the way through to the release of the new version of Firefox. Um, uh, some of the hard parts are like, uh, there may be things like we can update everything but screenshots and then have to wait for screenshots until much later because like right now it's only a nightly and, um, and I know some of the visuals like I think the bookmarks button is not even the final bookmarks button um, right. kind of thing. So there's, we got to wait for screenshots. Okay, so it, it seems to me that we're going to start the, the year with a, a lot of, of uh, exciting work, right, Michael? Um, yeah, it's cool. It's, no, it's very... Look at that, uh, at the post I linked to where you can download the latest nightly and see it, and it's, it's going to be very cool. Well, that's, that's, that's great, Michael. So um, I think that you and I will work on a little schedule so that we can help everyone go through the articles that need to get updated. Um, and uh, yeah, I mean, if you have time on your hands, just ask Michael how he can be of help, right? Yep. Perfect. Thanks. Thanks a lot, Michael. Uh, I'm very glad to see that we're finally getting ready for Astralis. I think it looks very cool, and it's time. It's time to get it out there at the door, right? Yeah. Fantastic. Um, okay. So, um, Elton, uh, we actually have a new dashboard, and we were testing it before the break. Um, and we realized that a couple of things weren't working the way they were intended to, so we fixed it. And then Kadir, Ricky, and I decided not to uh, put it out there before the break because we weren't going to be able to respond, right? So if there was something wrong, any bugs or anything, um, anyone who wanted to work uh, throughout this holiday break uh, couldn't have. But we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna pilot and we're gonna test the new um, Elton and dashboard soon. Uh, we're trying to make it so that you only see the articles that are actually need to be translated um, so that you have a to-do list rather than a huge long list of very different categories um, with articles that are up to date or uh, not up to date. Um, Kadir, is there, um, is there anything you want to uh, you wanna comment? Actually, that's exactly what we're going to do. Um, so there are going to be lots of smaller changes also in the coming weeks. Um, there is a blog post on the Sumo blog that explains exactly where we want to where we want to be when we are done, um, and we will get there in small incremental steps. Uh, so look out for that. Okay, perfect. So everyone, if you see changes, uh, don't panic and let us know if that if that's helpful. Um, if you, you think there's anything that could be improved, we have we had quite a you know quite a few conversations on Bugzilla, but maybe you missed that. Um, it's not a problem. Just let us know if you have any feedback on that, and we'll be rolling it out today, right, Kadir? Yeah, actually, I sent you a message about that, but uh, we can roll it out today. We are ready for that, um, and if there is no other issues, so we can see then. Perfect. Perfect. I think that's a great idea. Um, okay, Madalena, is there anything you want to talk about on the on the forum? John? So there are no big updates, um, considering we were away for two weeks. Uh, but this week we're going to work on the goals for 2014. Uh, that is what are going to do with the forum this year. Um, and we'll do that consider taking into consideration all the feedback that we have right now on the on the contributor forms because there's a lot that we need to think through. 
Um, so basically, this is what's going to happen this week. Uh, we'll definitely communicate what they're working on um, and what are the plans. So stay tuned because uh, I think there will be like a lot of great things happening this week with the forum. Uh, this week, sorry, this year uh, with the forum. So yes, that's it from me. That's great. That sounds very, very cool. I'm very eager to see the changes too. Uh, so help desk, Patrick, you want to take this one? Um, it's just a very short update. We're just getting back into the, the flow of things here in 2014. And, uh, we're working on uh, the escalations that are getting promoted by uh, the contributors, uh, as well as trying to make sure that everything gets answered within 72 hours um, so if you see any uh, if you see any posts that are they're getting kind of old jump in there and, and answer them because everybody that posts to the forums uh, deserves to to get a response from us um, so try hard and uh, and if you don't know the answer go ahead and escalate it to us and we'll take a look perfect that sounds great uh, anyone, anything else you want to say? We're actually very good in time, um, but I don't want to cut anyone. Is there any, anyone joining us or anyone on IRC that has any questions? See there. Okay, it seems good. So uh, actually, we don't have a contributor of the week. We have rather the contributors of the year. And, mm. uh, as I told you, they're listed in the blog post, so go there and check out the contributors of the year. Michael just told me that he is in the list of the LTN. Uh, I don't know, maybe it was uh, my fat fingers or something I'm going to check out. But maybe uh, Michael is secretly translating things into pirate, right? And he's just not letting us know. Um, so I'll, I'll check that. Maybe uh, the, the pirate localization is no, very it's, uh, well No, it's San mentioned. Antonio speak. Oh, yeah, the Texan it's one, right? Texan, it's a Texan. <laughs> Oh my God! E no no E N T X. Is that your? <laughs> there you go. <laughs> okay, so it seems to me that Michael is very good at making the E N T X uh, translation. Um, so you know, try to find that one. Um, again, as I said, thank you everyone for making it there. Um, thank you. Uh, I just wanted to say that someone like Corel, uh, who is on top of that list, has more than twenty thousand uh, answers uh, in the forum, which is just you know, incredible. Tonas from the localization around 800 edits. I mean, those are just crazy numbers. So I just wanted oh, to no, say so that. Oh, no, the Thunderbird work too, which is not showing on those counts. But it will be after our transition. Woo. Yes, yes, yes. No, no, absolutely. And um, I don't know, is Ricky on the line? I don't think he's on the line, right? Um, because um, I wanted to share with you uh, a, a blog post. Um, let me see. Here it is. I'm going to paste it to the Etherpad and to IRC. Ricky, I uh, gather a lot of very interesting um, stats and numbers around um, around uh, 2013. So if you check it, you have some metrics there. You have page views, visits, unique visits, everything. That's pretty cool. So just um, I pasted it there in the contributors of the um, of the year. Um, underneath that, and I'm going to paste it again on uh, IRC. Uh, so check that out. Uh, I think it's a very interesting post uh, from Ricky. And it's very cool to see those numbers all together there, right? Very cool. So does anyone have any questions? Um, or do we want to start the year right now and get going and get some amazing Sumo work done? Okay, it seems to me that everyone's ready to go and, and have a great time. Thanks, everyone, for helping us making 2000, 2013 such a great year. As you see, we're ready to get started, and we have a bunch, a bunch of things that we're going to do this year, and we count on you, and you can count on us. So yeah. have a great year. Uh, we hope you, you could rest a little bit, and let's, 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 let's get things done right now. Let's kick it. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Have Bye a guys. great week, everyone. Bye-bye. I love Bye. 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 Bye.